Mono wakes up in a dark room with lights that are off. The lights suddenly turn on. Mono's father, Mono's father is sitting right in front of him. He, he pulls out a picture of the Sivita asking Mono what he knows about it. Mono doesn't say anything and his father side. His father tells Mono that you are not out in trouble. And I get why you are concerned enough to know what's going on here. Father says I will set you free under one condition. You leave this place forever. I don't tell anyone. You will ever talk about this and nothing will happen to you. Mono replied why. But the father was confused and said to Mono just leave this place. I don't want you to be a part of this. To be a part of this. Mono then said be part of what? Instead of experimenting with humans and trying to control them with TVs? I thought I picked it, I know what you are planning. The father cries, I will I give you one I give you one final chance to leave this place. Mao says no, I'm not leaving this place. Mao's father tried to grab it, but some sort of blue power pushed him back. Mao's father realizes that he went too far into a single tower. And he has I have powers now. Father starts to add a little at a little weird. The light shuts off. And when the light cracks on, his father suddenly turns into a tall, shadowy figure just like he saw when the blue light got, got him. He then starts to chase him and even teleport. Mono hits a dead end, and then his father starts to walk towards him. With nowhere to run, Mono uses his blue power to push him back, and he runs away. He soon finds a room full of TVs, and one of them lights up. He goes, he goes through it, and he's suddenly, he suddenly in the middle of nowhere, with a single tower staying right in front of him. The Sino Tower seems to be unfinished though, every building looks one down, it's like he just went back in time.